Hi, in this screencast we're going to talk about optimizing your viewing area inside the Firefox browser. Uh, there are a lot of people that has given up the luxury of having a big screen monitor desktop and choose to use laptop laptops because of its mobility. The downside of using a laptop is the smaller screen, of course. So uh, setting up your browser to have the most viewing area can be helpful sometimes. right? So I'm just going to show you uh, how I would go about optimizing my view area. Okay, So let's open up uh, my Firefox. And I just want to show you something that I uh, do every day, which is reading RSS feeds. Okay, I can pull feeds from various websites and just read them on one page. And for example, I have the Yahoo News feed. So these are all Yahoo headlines. Okay. Let me just minimize the sidebar here. So as you can see, we I can probably read 2 4 6 8 10 12 uh, 12 news uh, per page and if I want to read more I would just scroll down or pull my bar down okay but no matter what I would always get about 12 feeds per page okay so uh, what if I can uh, read more okay have more viewing area for uh, to read my headlines okay that would be wonderful okay so uh, of course, uh, this is using uh, 800 by 600 resolution. I usually go higher, uh, but uh, I'm just trying to prove a point here. Okay, so as you can see, we have a lot of uh, spaces here. We have a bookmark toolbar, we have the navigation toolbar, okay, and then also the menu bar, right, and also at the bottom we have the status bar. Okay, So uh, having all these uh, extra space we can actually free up all these space and uh, give us more viewing area. And let me show you how we would do that. And uh, what we're going to be talking about is mainly uh, changing the functions within uh, the view area, the view um, drop downs. Okay? So if you click on view and then uh, toolbars, you'll see that um, navigation toolbar is checked and bookmark toolbar is checked. Uh, Roboform, uh, this is something I use, is unchecked. So what if we uncheck the bookmarks toolbar? You see that the bookmarks is gone. Uh, personally, I use that a lot, so uh, I try to keep that. Okay, but if you don't use it, it's a shortcut shortcut toolbar for your bookmarks. Okay, uh, if you don't need it, you can disable it. Uh, by default, it's there. Okay, so uh, now what do we get? We get two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, thirteen. Yay! We can read one more news right in one page. So. Uh, let's go back to the toolbars and navigation toolbar. Uh, if you click on this, uncheck it, you'll get a lot of viewing area. However, um, this viewing toolbar is pretty important. So, uh, navigation toolbar, I mean. So, I wouldn't recommend uh, disabling it. But we can do something else with it. Uh, let's see here. Okay, we can go ahead and customize. Okay, uh, there are plenty of uh, icons you can use. Okay, uh, but I wouldn't recommend adding more icons onto the page if you don't need them. Okay, and uh, what we're doing is trying to optimize, trying to cut down, not to add more. Okay, so uh, we can actually change the icons over here. A little bit, okay. 
it has a drop down here inside this um, setup page. You can do icons and text, which makes it larger. Uh, you can do icons only, which is default right now. And you can also just use text. Okay. Uh, I like doing this actually, doing icons and then making it small. Right, you see the difference? Okay. So let me hit done. So now let's see how many lines we get. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, almost fourteen. Okay. So uh, we can uh, do something more. Uh, the status bar is this at the bottom. Okay. Uh, a lot of times you may need it, you may not need it. Okay. Um, but if you don't see the need for it, you can go ahead and disable it by unchecking the status bar like that. Okay. So now you can see that you have a lot more viewing area. Okay, so we get 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, almost 15 lines. Um, I'm going to go ahead and um, bring back the status bar because I use it a lot. Okay, and uh, there's one more that I want to show you is uh, full screen, okay, which is the F11 hotkey. Look at this. If I click this, it makes my screen, uh, it makes it full screen, it takes out the blue uh, title bar, okay, let me show you again, right, you see this blue title bar, it takes it out. It also takes out the uh, the books bookmarks uh, toolbar, okay, and the status bar all together, so you get the maximum viewing area, okay. Uh, this is good if you know that you're going to be on this page for a while, but uh, uh, there are times that you do want to navigate around, so this may or may not be the best option for you, but th it's there if you need it. Okay, you can restore. If you want, you can hit F11 again. Okay, restore. All right, so uh, that's uh, how to optimize your viewing area, okay, using the view uh, drop down uh, menus. Okay. And that's it for this screencast. Thank you.